the ones around here. And last week, you know, I've been doing a lot of talking on the news regarding China and Russia and Ukraine. Are we going to go towards a World War III? What's going to happen? But there is one particular place, one particular interview that I found interesting. And so the guy asked, made a comment that we're sending money to Ukraine, even though egg prices are out of control here. And I really hadn't been paying attention to egg prices. However, I decided to check it out. They are higher. Uh, I look at the causes from an anti-fragility standpoint. What are the causes? What can I do? And what are the opportunities? So, root cause, a couple things. Uh, COVID, avian flu, killed off about 50 million chickens, so supply is down. Uh, fuel costs make feed more expensive. And uh, there's some talk that egg producers are gouging people. Now, what is in my control in that? Zero. However, if I were to say, okay, where's the opportunity? People are going to need substi egg substitutes, particularly in baking, or people are going to need alternative sources of eggs, such as growing them on their own. So I looked up how much a chicken coop would cost. So if someone want to do it. And the most expensive one I found on Amazon was fifteen hundred bucks. So fifteen hundred bucks, a few chickens, probably such about two thousand, twenty five hundred bucks. You got eggs. You have you can make a, an egg business, or you can sell chicken wire, or you can invest in other sources of well, egg substitutes. So it's just something to look at. I'm not telling you to rush out and buy a chicken coop. Just simply to say, hey, something changed. There's going to be winners. There's going to be losers. How do I find the opportunity in this? And what is the necessary adaptation? And who makes that possible? And that's where your opportunity is.